Hey guys, I want to do my pull for March the 5th. Here we go, decent amount. Some are back issues, some are new ones. Um, start with Marvel, move to DC, then do my indies. Um, Alright, uh, first off we have Loki, Agents of Asgard, number two. Um, this book isn't actually on my pull. Um, I just picked it up off the shelf. I'm still not sure about it yet. I read the first one and I enjoyed it, so that's why I picked up this one, but overall we'll see. I don't know, we'll see if I keep it. Uh, next up will be She-Hulk, number two. I am pretty excited to read this. I enjoyed the first one a lot. A lot of, uh, like I don't, I don't really read anything about She-Hulk, so, you know, before this series, so it's, uh, it's neat to see. And I, you know, I don't mind the fact that she kind of, that she's, you know, kind of, she does stay green, right? And, uh, the art, I just don't mind. People are babies. A bunch of babies. <laughs> uh, next up is Magneto, number one. Um, I am very excited to read this. Colin Bunn is writing it. Gabriel Hernandez Walta is on the art. I'm a little worried, though, that in picking this up and reading this and me only picking up Amazing X-Men otherwise as far as X titles are concerned that I'm gonna get a little a little lost so we will wait and see how that turns out I hope it's kind of doing its own thing from what I hear it is so hence me picking it up uh, next up is DC and I have Green Lantern number 29 um, it's uh, another one of those series that started off so well and kind of, I don't know, pooched it. I like the cover though, that, that's really cool. A lot of animals and you see Hal in the background, I don't know if you can see it there, it's hiding. Um, next up is a book that I jumped on as of today, but I only picked up a back issue is Supergirl number 25 because of the whole Green Lantern stuff and Red Lantern stuff. Um, and as you'll see in a video tomorrow, there's a reason, another reason why I picked it up. So we'll see. I like the way it looks though. Will Bill's never been my favorite writer, but he's done some stuff that I've enjoyed, so... Hopefully that's another one of the ones that I enjoy from him. Uh, next up is Image. The first two are back issues. Uh, or, sorry, not just Image, but independent, I should say. Uh, black Science number three. The second, sorry, the second printing. A uh, long week at work. Um, I've already read these, or this online, as well as Black Science number four, first printing. Again, another one I've already read. I read them on Comixology, so I've paid for them twice now because of my shop. Uh, that's a weird song. Next up is a new number one, and that is from Dark Horse Comics, and that's Veil, vale, Great Rucka, art by Tony Fejula. I don't know. I hope that's right. Um, I only got to flip through it quick, but it looks. I, don't know, I like the art in this. One of those uh, super neat. And the, I've heard Big Rocket write some good stuff. I haven't read anything by him before, so we'll see how that turns out for me. I'll let y'all know if I'm going to continue picking it up, I guess. Uh, the next one is my most anticipated book for the month, actually. And that is Evil Empire, number one, written by the great Max Bemis from Say Anything, and the art by Ransom Getty, and released from Boom Studios. Um, I've never read a Boom book, so I'm kind of excited about that to start with. Secondly, I love Say Anything, and I'm excited to to read a book by, shit, a book by, um, Max Bemis. 
who is the lead singer and writer of that band. Yeah, anyway, super, super excited right now. I love this cover art. Simple, but it looks cool, even on the back. And the art inside is done very well as well. It's just my style. Anyway, uh, that's all I have for now. I will more than likely be posting a video tomorrow. And then I will probably be posting a video on Sunday as well. I'm going to go to the used bookstore on Saturday. Um, I also bought like a, a lot of books from a dude that I'm picking up tomorrow. So, yeah. Well, uh, I'll let you all see that then. Cool. Thanks for watching.